Hello, this is from Milwaukee to Nashville. I'm Daniel Goodemo, your host, uh, with the most info about the Nashville Goalie Pipeline. And just to honor goalies, you know. Gotta have some catering going. Alright. So we're going to start off with Nashville here. And who's in their pipe and, and, and going to be the starters, which is obvious. That'll be Pecorine and UC Soros. Alright. So, Juice, as we call him. Don't mind me. Just getting the bugs out here. And getting comfy. Because I'm going to be here a while. Alright, UC Saros, 24 years old, had 5'10", catches left-handed, 179 pounds, 81 kilograms for those of you who weigh by kilograms. Uh, he has a gold medal with the World Junior Championship under 20. He has a World Cup, two silvers, and a World Junior under 18 bronze. Last season for the Predators, he played 31 games with a 2.62 uh, 2 goals against and a .915 save percentage. He had one playoff game where he was a 1.33 goals against and a .952 save percentage. Um, and for those of you, that was UC Soros. Bobblehead Soros. On to the next guy. Next guy being this guy. Which you can buy this lovely little bobblehead on MilwaukeeAdmirals.com. $30 you get a Pecorine bobble, Pontus Aberg, Frederick Gaudreau, or no, Pontus Aberg, Victor Arvidsson, Pekka, and UC Soros. Or no, not Soros. Um, Roman Yossi. So, with Pex comes experience and a lot of size. He is six foot five, uh, 216 pounds. He's 36 years old towards the end of his career. I believe he will play till he's 40. Last year for the Prayers, he played in 56 games, had a 2.42 goals against and a .918 save percentage. He played in six games of the playoffs with a 3.09 goals against and a .9505 save percentage. Not as best work. On to the goalies in the system. These are guys who are unsigned. It is really warm in here. So I gotta stay hydrated. It's really humid out here, folks. All right. So on to the goalies. We have Nicholas Westerholm, Connor Ingram, Milan Klucek. Thomas Vamaka, Konstantin Volkov, and Ethan Hader. Nicholas Westerholm could either play with the Admirals or play for Saipai. He is six foot four, two twenty-two years old. He is hundred and ninety-eight pounds, ninety kilograms for those of you who pay attention. Ugh. All right, he catches left-handed, signed through 2021. Uh, currently, he is low on Desai Pai. 
Last year he played for Liga, uh, the Liga, which is uh, the team name is Saipai. Played 15 games, 2.27 goals against, a point zero nine seven. Uh, point nine zero seven goals against. He had zero games in the playoffs. Not much to look at for him. Up next we have Connor Ingram, who is most likely slated to be the Admirals' backup this year. He is twenty two years old, six foot two, catches left handed, uh, one ninety six, uh, ninety eight kilograms. For those of you who weigh by kilograms. He is signed through 2019-2020. At the end of the year, he'll get a new contract. He played junior hockey for the Humble Broncos. RIP, every player that died in that bus crash. Um, last season, he played for the Syracuse Crunch, 22 games. A 2.26 goals against a .922 goals, or 922 save percentage. He played for the Orlando Solar Bears in the ECHL at the end of the season. Played 13 games, had 2.81 goals against, and had a uh, .914 save percentage. He also played 10 games in the playoffs for the Orlando Solar Bears. He had a 1.94 goals against average and a save percentage of .935. That is really good. He has played also a career of 35 games in the in 2017-2018 he played tw 35 games for the Syracuse Crunch he had a 2.2 2.33 goals against and he had a point nine one four save percentage he also played in four games in the playoffs with a 3.07 goals against and a point zero nine uh, point nine zero four goal uh, save percentage um he had played for the Adirondack Thunder that year as well Playing three games, he had a 1.30 goals against and a .960 save percentage. Uh, has no NHL experience. Milan Kluczek, who will be playing for... He is 21 years old, 6'3", 196, 89 kilograms for those of you who that weighs that... He was 196. He catches left-handed. He's from the Czech Republic. He is currently going to be playing for Motor CS Motor Chess Buvik. Uh, last year he played for Hockey Club Prevro in the Czech Two League. He played 11 games, 2.25 goals against it, a point nine. Two five save percentage. He was the seventh round pick by the Nashville Predators. Thomas Vamaka. I think very highly of this guy. He made a bit bold jump coming over to the U.S. He is from the Czech Republic, uh, Trotnov, Czech Republic. He is six foot three, one sixty five. Uh, Weigh is uh, 75 kilograms for those of you that weigh that way. Uh, le uh, left handed catch. Um, he played for the University of Connecticut last year. 15 games played, 2.32 goals against, a .922 save percentage. He played in the under juniors. He did not play his best hockey there. Under 19, uh, international juniors, three games, 4.29 with a .9. For two goals against. He also played for the Czech Republic under 20. He had a two two games played, five goals against, and that's 5.00 across the board. He had a .861 save percentage. We're going to call it on Ethan Hader here. Ethan Hader. He is a He's a 17-year-old, 6 foot 2 goalie, weighs 207, catches left-handed. He is going to play for the Sioux City Musketeers this year. And then in the next year he's going to play for Clarkson University. Last year for the Minnesota Magicians and the NAHL, 
He played 37 games with a 2.35 goals against and a .926 save percentage. He also played in six games in the playoffs with a 3.67 goals against and a .883 save percentage. To the final guy, we uh, uh, as far as the Nashville pipeline, these are guys that the Predators have uh, restrictions or can sign at any time. He is 21 years old from Miraminsk, Russia. He is six foot three, two twelve, catches left-handed. He's a sixth-round pick by the Nashville Predators. He will be playing for Yuguri Kantniminska. Uh, he played for them last year. He had a 1.3 a goals against in two games with a .944 goals against. He also played for Sokol Karnieski. He played six games for them with a 3.1 goals against and a .911 save percentage. Um, and that rounds that out. Now on to the Admiral side of things. We have, and this guy is signed under the Nashville Predators. And that's the last guy. We got Troy Grosnick from Brookfield, Wisconsin. Yes, I have a Troy Grosnick bobblehead with a cheese head. What's up, Timmy? All right, so with that, we have Ken Appleby, Troy Grosnick, Cam Johnson. I already talked about Connor Ingram. Oops, sorry, kitty. I'm sorry I elbowed you in the face. Ken Appleby, six foot four, twenty-four years old, two oh nine, catches left-handed. He has an OHL and a minor league cup. Uh, he played for the Manitoba Moose last year, ten games, uh, three point nine two goals against and a point eight eight four save percentage. Then he also played in 15 games for the Jacksonville Iceman. He had a 2.45 goals against and a .923 save percentage. He played in four playoff games for them with a 2.76 goals against and a .905 save percentage. Um, he is currently under an AHL contract. Also add into that, we have Cam Johnson. I'm going to do Troy Grossnick last because we all know what he did. Hi, kitties. Both of my fuzzy little friends came up here to say hello. So we have Cam Johnson from Troy, Michigan. He is 25 years old, 6'1", 205, 93 kilograms for those of you who pay attention. Uh, Left-handed catch. He signed to an AHL deal with the Milwaukee Admirals. Last year he played for the Binghamton Devils with a 9.74 goals against and an 8. Or a .872 save percentage in 29 games. He also played for the Adirondack Thunder. 10 games, two goal, 2.54 goals against, and a .915 save percentage. Um, he will be signed under the Milwaukee Admirals at the uh, going into camp. Trey Grosnick. He is 30. He is going to be 30 years old on October 27th of this year. Welcome to the 30 Club, Troy. Uh, from Brookfield, Wisconsin, 6'1", 185, catches left-handed. He is currently signed to the Predators through 2019-2020. Last year for the Admirals, he played in 46 games with a 2.41 goals against uh, a .919 save percentage, five games in the playoffs, six, uh, 3.62 goals against, and a .874 save percentage. That is our goalie breakdown. Let me know what you think. I'm sorry I had to do this video again, guys. We will get back to you guys uh, shortly. I will be doing the defenseman video either Wednesday or Thursday. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Go Admirals. Go Predators. Follow, like, subscribe.